Let's keep it going for Kyle, everyone. Hello. Hi. Um, so, for those of you who don't know me, I'm a pretty nerdy guy. Um, I didn't really get into sports until I came to Philadelphia, and really then it was only out of obligation. I mean, even the nerdiest kid in Philadelphia will play Dungeons and Dragons and then go watch an Eagles game. So it felt like I kind of had to like get into some sport. And I happened to move here the same year that the Philadelphia Union came into town. So, and I've always played soccer my whole life. I've always been a fan. And I couldn't stand it when the Metro Stars became the Red Bulls. So I decided, all right, I'm going to start getting back into American soccer. And over the last couple of years, they had their highs and their lows. Um, anyone here follow the Union? <laughs> all right. So um, they're not like the best team, but they're definitely not the worst. Um, but last year they had a really good season and they were in the Lamar Cup Championship, which for those of you who don't know, it's actually the second oldest tournament in America next to the Stanley Cup. Uh, they actually kept it running when the league shut down and it was amazing. We, uh, the Philadelphia Union was actually favored and uh, we're all like, this is the big, this is the first championship game the city has seen since 2008, and no one knows. Like, it was crazy. Like, you're all amped up, getting ready to go to the stadium, and no one even knows anything's going on. It wasn't until you, like, got into Chester that anyone even was, like, blue and gold or anything like that. So, uh, the, I had this friend, we're in the Sons of Ben, which is the spot you want to be sitting in. It's where we make a lot of noise, and we yell at the other team, and we bang drums. And uh, we're on like the third row, right behind the goal. And we get out, and they come out like lightning. And it's just amazing. We're playing the Seattle Sounders, who have Clint Dempsey, the greatest American to ever play the game. And he's on the field playing against us. And we're just, we're really doing, we're dominating them in the first half. And then about almost before half, we score a goal. And we're up 1-0. And here we are. We're all going out halftime, and we're talking to each other like, dude, Oh my God, we're gonna get a championship in Philadelphia. People are gonna finally start respecting soccer in this town. And you know, we're gonna rush the field. We're all talking and, and then the second half starts and it comes out. And you know, we finally, I, I finally felt like a Philadelphia fan at this point to see victory just snatched away because we, the, the game starts and we come out really good, but then it's very clear that we are being just overpowered by the Seattle Sounders. And about halfway through the, the second half, boom, Seattle scores and we're even. And all of a sudden, the crowd starts to temper down. And all of a sudden, about, you know, the game starts to pick up and we start to have a chance. And then, wham, Clint Dempsey scores another goal right in front of my face and runs to the corner to celebrate and the crowd goes silent. You can hear a pin drop. And I don't know what came over me. I've never done this before in my life, but it was probably a lot of the liquid courage I'd been drinking at the game. I turn to the crowd and I just scream, Philadelphia! And like, the whole crowd, like, all right, let's be honest, it was probably like 500 people, because it's soccer. But <laughs> they all yell, Philadelphia! And I started this chant. And I'd never done that before. I'd never really gone to a game and got into it and, and you know, seen my team lose. And so <laughs> I finally felt like a Philadelphia sports fan. And we may have lost, but I think I gained something. And uh, now I'm a pretty big sports fan. So go, go Eagles.